Hello, dear Libra. Today I am ready and prepared for this reading, with advice, revelations, and tarot prophesies for you. I hope you are doing very well. I thank you infinitely for your presence, for your likes, and your beautiful comments. Of course, also for your subscription. It really makes me very happy that you are here. Please stay until the end. If you are here, it may not be by chance. Maybe there is a message that you need to hear right now. Remember that you are the owner of your future, and you are free to make your own decisions. Keep in mind that these messages are general. If they do not resonate with you, let them go. Now let's look at the energies that are developing in different areas of your life, such as love, money, health, and family. First, I leave you with the tip of the day. It's been a while since you've experienced feelings of coldness. That's not a problem. However, don't let them take over your life, just days when emotions are organizing themselves. Taking the easy way out won't be a tempting option today. This doesn't mean you habitually adopt that philosophy by any means, but it could be said that everyone feels drawn to it from time to time. That's not the case for you, though, because planetary aspects give you the strength to follow all the necessary steps, no matter how extensive. If anyone tries to convince you otherwise, stand your ground. Your motivation today could be a desire to get intimate with a loved one. If you are in a relationship, you may want to organize a romantic evening. If you are single, you may consider expanding your social circle to meet potential partners. You may also want to read something on the subject, but remember to remain objective, and that can be difficult today. Things aren't all that great today, so don't push it too hard. You feel like sinking into your fantasy world forever. Don't be tempted to consume any kind of chemical substance, as it will only cause more confusion. Finish your work and let loose a bit. Retreat into the depths of your mind and explore the fantasies within you. While yesterday was a day to let the fire burn brightly, today is a day to put it out. You'll find that strength will emerge as you get to know yourself and focus on yourself rather than trying to venture outward. This is especially true with your romantic relationships, and you'll find that the more stable and dependable you are, the more attractive you'll be to your lover. Let someone else take the lead today, you will not be in the mood to make any kind of decision. You will find that you have a great impetus to act, but for some reason you do not know how to proceed. Put things off for a few days. Now is a time to let your mind relax. There is a lot of confusion in the air today, do not add to it. Your thought process may take a hitch as you discover that there are certain rules and guidelines that must be followed. Sometimes you feel that you are above all these rules, that you can set your own based on your moral sense and everything will be fine. Unfortunately, sometimes you must obey rules that are not yours. Don't feel upset. Face it. Below are your lucky numbers and color for today. But first, I invite you to leave me a like. Your support encourages me to continue with my readings, hoping to help you in your daily life. Your ruling numbers for today are 64 and 88. Try to use them as much as possible. Take advantage of them since they will only be with you for today. If you have the opportunity to participate with these numbers in a drawer, don't miss the chance to do so. Your lucky color for today is blue. Try to wear some clothing in this color, or you could wear an accessory that contains it, as this will bring luck to your day and it will also make you look incredible. If throughout the day you have to choose something that contains this or another color, do not hesitate to choose the one that contains your lucky color. It's time for you to take a well-deserved break. You're doing everything you can in this last stage of what is in your power to be more and more stable. However, let me tell you that there is a very important, very vital decision that you may not have made and that you simply have not paid enough attention to. Think, what are your true dreams? What do you aspire to? What motivates you and keeps you active? Take notes about it and, above all, 
Make your wish list. How long has it been since you started making a wish list? Well, by having a clear and concise answer to all these questions, believe me, life will become much easier for you. In addition, today the position of Mercury, which is the planet of communication, but not only verbal, but also mental, makes your objectives much more organized, but only if we are willing to organize them. This way, you won't be lost and you'll know that, regardless of the path you take, your goal will be to end up in the place you had previously planned. It is also very important for you to know that the things that happen around you now do not have to bother you. Let's say that it depends a lot on the state of thin skin that each person has, as they say. That is something personal, but do not resist life itself and learn to flow with it, with its essence, with its way of being. Because that is what will allow you to live peacefully, without any kind of worries. You feel like laying the foundations for a project you have, and now is a good time. At work, a tough period awaits you that will bring rewards in the future. You will have work changes that will affect you, but in a positive sense. You will have to deal with some family issues, but not very important ones. Avoid confronting people in arguments, say things delicately. You will be compatible with natives of Scorpio and Cancer. If you put a little more interest in living together, you will solve problems in love. You have to take better care of yourself to recover your charm and health as always. Think about yourself. Give yourself strength and enthusiasm to undertake new things. Take advantage of it. If you have headaches, it is because of accumulating tension. Relax a little. If you are far from your partner, do not hesitate any longer and write that letter. Send the expected notice, that message on your phone and get in touch. Any unfortunate incident from the past can be fixed with a sensitive and civilized talk. A new door is opening that was closed to you. You are going to meet the person who may have the key to emotional happiness and prosperity. There are different ways to achieve your goals, but only one will allow you to achieve them in the time you want. This way involves care, dedication, and effort. Rushing the process is often the cause of goals being postponed and not being satisfactorily achieved. Expressing your feelings at the moment they arise is the way to avoid the disappointment you are experiencing. Avoid feeling ignored or not given the space and recognition you deserve. It is important to make your feelings heard clearly and forcefully. Do not keep emotions that can turn into negativity. The universe is inviting you to take those first steps that you have been contemplating for some time. There is something you have been going to do, a project or a decision that you have been putting off due to fear or uncertainty. However, the message is clear. It is time to take the step and trust that the universe is conspiring in your favor. Although the beginning may seem intimidating, the path will become clearer with each step you take. The key is to move forward with confidence. Knowing that although the first step does not take you directly to where you want to go, it will get you out of the place you are currently in. This day presents itself with the renewing energy of the color green, a symbol of healing and new beginnings, like the first shoots of a plant that announce the arrival of spring. This is a time for something new to blossom in your life. Keep your thoughts positive and focus your energy on your goals, as this will allow you to move forward with greater ease and security. According to some astrological interpretations, the color green is also related to abundance and emotional stability, suggesting that this is a good time to sow the seeds of what you want to see grow in the future. In terms of health, there is nothing that bothers you. Generally speaking, your health is increasingly impeccable and in adequate condition, except, obviously, in those of you who already have a chronic illness that requires constant medical supervision. All this is due to an emotional and sentimental balance that is reflected in the physical part. Let's say that, if we feel good internally, you already know that the law of attraction makes you look radiant externally as well. That is to say, the body and the mind are interconnected and maintain a very special connection that, with the passage of time and without the necessary information, is gradually lost. 
people forget about the connection. You have to continue meditating and reflecting at every moment so that you can detect any type of irregularity in your system and find a solution. Be very patient and, above all, do not give shelter to stress, which is that ambiguous thing that gets on our nerves and then ends up taking its toll on us. So none of that. In terms of work, ask yourself, are you uncomfortable? Do you feel good? Do you feel that you are in a position where you can grow professionally and also as a human being, learning? Is there something you want or wish to improve? Well, these are questions that you have to ask yourself from time to time, but especially at this moment. Based on the answers, you will be able to have a better understanding of what may be happening in your life. If it is within your capacity to generate a change, then, obviously, make it happen. Every life is different and every life is different, but it is not necessary that you compare yourself with other people or with other types of people. You can take as a reference those colleagues or those successful people in your sector with whom you can have more and more confidence or greater coherence. What exactly is it that you want and that is where that wish list that I mentioned before comes in. Never stop asking yourself questions because even if you are in a work environment earning income and you may be stable, and maybe you are already at an age where you think you will not grow any more, do not underestimate the power you have within you. In addition, it can make you grow much more, since that is the responsibility of the planet Jupiter, which is the great expander, the one that expands absolutely everything. Keep trying, no matter how many times you are rejected. For those of you who are looking for work, if you have interviews lately, if you have different things to do, if you stay overnight or sleepy, there will be nothing you can do. It is important that you carry it out. You have to be constantly activated. You cannot wait for everything to fall from the sky, to be given to you on a silver platter. Less so for you, who are an active sign in that you like things to be given to you in the most coherent way possible. Attract the positive because you will soon enter a cycle in which, if you don't have a job yet, you will find one in no time. Change your mindset. Get active. Look for it. If you have an interview, give it your best shot and, from then on, success will be in your hands. In terms of financial matters, you are on the right track, even if it doesn't seem that way at times. Even if you sometimes think that things may be going your way, for some time now you have been making your merits and efforts to change your mentality regarding money. This is a big step. Don't diminish the impact that your beliefs can have on the monetary issue. Because it is what really makes you different and distinct. Remember that life is about constant learning and taking things from a more objective perspective. Money is something objective. When it comes to love, be very careful with that decision that may be floating around in your mind. Because if you already have a stable partner, it is something that, if well-focused, can make your relationship go much better and that the relationship expands in some way and that your growth is better and better. But if you are just starting a relationship and you have only been together for a few weeks, you probably lack objective data and you should get to know each other much more in depth. Note that when you decide to be with your partner, it is to learn and share with that great person who you know will be there for you and you for him or her. A relationship is based on respect, solidarity and, above all, love. This last value is very important in the relationship because it is what, in the beginning, should lead you to establish a commitment with that person. It turns out that, in your case, you may have been influenced by external situations or you have seen having a partner from the benefits of another type of angle. That is where you should reconsider. Not because the situation is bad, but because it can be better, and that is where love flows. If you and your relationship are doing well, it will become much stronger. On the other hand, if it is a tense relationship or there have been too many arguments lately, it will be time for you to start focusing on the relationship from another point of view. If you are single, the truth is that you are not yet ready or prepared to focus on a new relationship. 
There are many things that you still have to process and learn in order for you to feel capable enough to start a relationship from now on. Remember that you have other more important areas in your life right now that you have to pay attention to. Once they are stable and there are no problems, you will be facing the perfect and ideal moment where the cosmos will put you in contact with a great person who will teach you and make you live from another perspective. Mind you, this doesn't mean that those of you who are already getting to know someone, but aren't in a relationship yet, but do like each other and so on, it doesn't mean that it won't go any further. It does mean that you probably notice or perceive that you're not making progress, and above all, you should continue enjoying getting to know each other. As for energy, your energy is moderate. There may be a slight change of mood in the middle of the afternoon, but nothing out of the ordinary, nothing to worry about. New perspectives on life, new thoughts too, and great learning on the way. That's wonderful. The positive situation that you have to enhance today is sincerity. It's a characteristic that is quite typical of people of your sign. You don't say something just for the sake of it, but you say it when it comes from a heart. And that's something quite normal for you. On the negative side, be careful with excessive honesty. We're going to the other side. We just said that your virtue is sincerity, but today be careful because your defect will be excessive sincerity. Of course, honesty is a positive thing. However, if you take it to the point where you have no limits or limits, it won't help you. Give your opinion when you're asked, more or less, to be sure that you're not going to screw up. So be very careful with comments, but it's not a drama or anything negative. Don't worry. The negative situation that you also have to avoid is bad thoughts. Thoughts are something that can be controlled through emotions. Don't think that everything is going to go wrong. Don't get into defeatist mode or think that the world is against you because it's not true. It can be improved, yes, but it's not against you. And that's true. As for students, keep going as you are. It seems that sometimes you think that you are not making much progress, especially on days like today, and therefore sometimes you feel that you are not progressing. But do not expect constant approval from your tutors or teachers. As long as you know that everything is fine, that you are making progress, there is no reason to stop. It also depends on the schedules of each country. You already know that the student calendar is different in each country. So, depending on whether you are taking exams or not, take it easy. There will be days when you will have to study more and days when you will have to wait a little less. Today, objectivity. As for compatibility, today you have a wonderful day with these three signs. First of all, with people of the sign of Virgo, you have joy, stability, open-mindedness, and vision, and that is always wonderful. Secondly, with people of the sign of Libra, you have a lovely, close day, with much joy and integrity. Thirdly, with people of the Capricorn sign, any project, proposal, or situation is carried out easily. Dear Libra, this was your reading for today. As always, thank you so much for being here with me. Remember that the purpose of our predictions is to guide you, so that you can make more appropriate and correct decisions based on them. If you like these sessions, click on that like button. You can also subscribe and activate notifications so you don't miss the daily predictions. I hope you have a day full of positive manifestations. A big kiss to everyone.